saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. Well, hard to perform much. Well, this is about as decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive knees into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level yeah. of everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. Well, we probably trot out the term well-rounded in modern-day mixed martial arts more than we should, but this fighter certainly fits the bill. Oh, 110%. He can do everything inside the octagon. Where he is most comfortable is inside of that eight-sided structure where right. most men are terrified of being. But for this gentleman, he only wants to be there. When you try to wrestle him, he's able to defend takedowns. If you dare stand and strike with him, he can knock you out. He's got all the tools necessary to become a UFC champion. His first martial art, mixed martial arts, <laughs> and that's not always the case. He believes that he should. is palpable as this fight gets underway and gonna be interesting to see how this matchup plays out definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all and in those situations normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success i want to see how this plays out oh nice land there with the punch you see he's taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach big liver kick lands under the elbow these guys throwing early Straight right hand now, just misses. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Hooker. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Oh, nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. <laughs> you are battering that dude. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. <laughs> Whiffs on that offering. Knee to the body there. That one, though, blocked by Choi. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Big power punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Looked like it did stun him a little bit. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Big leg kick lands. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, and there's another leg kick for good measure. So doing a really good job with that weapon here tonight. And if you're trying to slow your opponent down, mission accomplished so far. When you can land that many leg kicks, you start to affect the movement. You start to affect the hands. Everything changes when you're blasting someone over and over and over with leg kicks and you start to see the damage, not only in the legs, but in the facial expression right. of his opponents. Nice loop and punch. Just out of range with the big right hand. Engage in a single collar tie. Oh, combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. There. He's so accurate. 
when he decides to attack. It is a sight to behold. Nice. Wow. The Korean Superboy gets hit by that kick to the midsection. You got to do better defensively. Trying to establish that jab once again. Booker gets the takedown. Could be big here. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Well, he's in a compromising spot here, DC. You got to figure out a way to get back to your feet. A lot of top pressure being applied here as he works out of side control. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. Well, these are some excellent ground and pound strikes here, DC. There's an efficiency with which he operates in these situations. He knows exactly when to throw, exactly when to hold, and it's allowing him to really control the grappling aspect of the fight. There's a sign there, right? Know when to hold him, know, know when, when to hold him. him. Yep, absolutely. Go. 20 seconds left. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. Ten seconds to go. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect. So fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land from anywhere. Oh, Horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, DC, let's look at some of the highlights from the last round. Lot for the replay guys to choose from. Yeah, man, these guys stood on a quarter in the middle of the octagon. Take one to give one. Over and over, each guy landed, and they both landed very well over the course of that first round. All right, so the next round is underway. Will it be more of the same? And by that, I mean all of those strikes to the body. You've got to think at some point the opposition is going to lower that guard or get finished. And that's exactly what he is hoping for. All those great body shots, all that damage he's putting on his opponent will force an opening up top where he will look to finish. Oh, effective strike there by the Korean Super Bowl. Superman punch. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Right hand on point. Oh, he landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach and certainly is making it count in this one. Oh, and he gets tagged. Beautiful combination there, and I'm not sure how many more of those power shots he can take, honestly. The night is almost over. If you keep getting hit with punches like this, you are going to sleep. Swing and a miss by the Korean Super Bowl. Nice body kick. Another big body kick lands. Outstanding kick there by the Korean Super Bowl. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Hooker's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Oh, that was a big takedown. Is this the one that's going to break him? All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. Got to be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Oh, these are some serious power punches from the top by Choi. Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hip escape. A lot of top pressure being applied here. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. 
Oh, nice job to reverse position on the ground. It was bad, but now it's not so bad. What a fantastic sweep. Let's go. Get him off. Get him. Hooker's got his back now. Well, anytime you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Missed with that right hand. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the feet. He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks. That was lightning fast, that right in. Oh, strong uppercut for him there. That'll get his attention. He lands another punch to the head. Oh, misses with the jab. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt away. Back. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Effective punch there by Hooker. Just misses with the straight right. Oh, that's a nice straight punch there. Threw the punch, got to the target. Choi's shot is blocked. Just misses with the jet. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Oh! He's out! Unbelievable! What a fight! Just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening, and barged right through it to get the knockout. Well, hard to perform much better than he did tonight. A huge knockout under the lights. They'll be talking about that one for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 21 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, the Korean Super Bowl, Du Ho Chong. All right, so there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive knockout for him to get.